Welcome to the Ogden City Council's quick meeting recap for the work session, City Council, and special RDA meetings that took place on Tuesday, October 4th, 2022. In the work session, the Council, also acting as the RDA, reviewed a proposed land transfer and development agreement and reimbursement agreement. Representatives from CED presented the proposed LTDA with Q Factor for the rehabilitation and development of 1.81 acres of land located at the Union Stock Exchange building and site within the Trackline Economic Development Area. Their proposal is to rehabilitate and expand the Union Stock Exchange building and build a second building on the same property to the east. The development of the site includes parking, site improvements, and historic preservation activities. This will be considered in the meeting on October 11th. The council, also acting as the RDA board, then discussed two budget amendments related to the Stock Exchange building. The proposed budget amendment from the city includes a transfer of $845,000 from the CIP fund to the RDA for the purchase of the exchange building. It also recognizes revenues of $88,200 from the United Way Homelessness Advocate Grant for the purchase of two police vehicles to support homeless outreach efforts. It also recognizes $106,700 in other miscellaneous grants. The proposed budget amendment from the RDA recognizes the transfer of $845,000 from the CIP fund and recognizes $200,000 that Q Factor will pay for the purchase of the stock exchange property. The agency will provide an incentive of $800,000 to Q Factor and use $40,000 for other development costs. These amendments will be considered in the meeting on October 11th. The council then reviewed and discussed a proposal from the Ogden Police Department regarding the sale of unclaimed firearms. OPD is requesting authorization to sell surrendered or seized firearms currently in the department's custody for public use. Their proposal reduces inventory, creates storage space for incoming items, and is in accordance with Utah State Code. The firearms will be sold by High and Mike's Pawn Shop, and the proceeds will be given to the Weber Morgan Narcotic Strike Force. Most firearms surrendered or seized by OPD are destroyed. Only firearms that have significant value or are collectible will be sold to High and Mike's. This resolution will be considered in the meeting of October 11th. In the council meeting, the council approved a rezone of property at 539 22nd Street. The ordinance rezones the southern portion of this property from CBDCO, Central Business District slash Conditional Overlay, to R3EC, Residential Multifamily East Central. This allows the owner to comply with the requirements of of the R3EC zoning regarding the renovation of the fourplex on the property. The rezone is necessary for the implementation of the East Central Community Plan. In the special RDA meeting, the board voted to adjourn into a closed session. The entire recording from the meetings of October 4th can be accessed on the Ogden City Council's Facebook page and podcast with timestamps to skip to specific agenda items. If you have any questions or comments, please reach out to the council office at 801-629-8153 or send an email to citycouncil at ogdencity.com.